Hello there, everybody. This is Silent Mist, and where the heck are we? Well, we're in what is the beginning of my house. Um, <laughs> I, I got... Uh, it's been a while since we've been on here, but I've done a little bit since then, and mainly by that I mean I put a house here at spawn, finally for me to live in, and it's it's really house-like, and well, it's not bad, but it certainly isn't a fantastic house. But um, yeah, it's pretty much just the framework, the general framework of a house. There isn't much in it yet, but uh, I'm gonna start to put the basic machines in here. In the future, all of my machines are probably not going to be in here. Uh, we're just going to have a few, just because I don't want to have a big old base with a bunch of stuff loaded in its spawn. So what I'm probably going to do is have like a portal in here between spawn and my base. So it'll be a wonderful, wonderful sort of, I don't even, what am I even trying to say? I don't know. But I have a bunch of stuff that I, I think I made a few things in between parts, mainly these, um, whoop, these leadstone energy frames, which... It's a pretty simple recipe. I just wanted something that I could store a fair amount of energy in. So I made those and yeah, they'll be a good source of temporary power. So I guess I should install them. Actually, how do I want to do this? I have a feeling, I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna set up the base yet. I have a feeling that this wall is going to be uh, chests and whatnot. And of course, Facebook is happening. Facebook, what do you want from me? I don't even, I don't even, I think like every, major chat that I'm a part of is like set to do not disturb so oh whoa that was laggy I just heard the sound from uh me placing the block right then but what I'm gonna do is set up machines along this wall so that means I'm gonna need to wire up this portion of the base and then I'm gonna have chests on this wall just because well we need lots of chests and we don't currently have lots of chests we need to change that. Uh, we definitely do. Um, I also, let's see, in between, right before I started up Minecraft, I got a couple of texture packs just because I wanted to see what they'd look like. Let's let's try out Sortex. Oh, I click it and it lags. That's really something I shouldn't, I shouldn't, uh, shouldn't be surprised about. <laughs> Come on, game. Don't, don't crash on me or anything. Oh, come on game game oh good 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 whoa things look different things look very different indeed whoa I I don't know what to expect I don't particularly dislike it but like I said it's not what I expected it's certainly a bit different but uh, what are we doing right now? You might be asking while well, I'm clearing out some space for the, uh, I guess, the power system that I'm going to have here at spawn. It's not going to be a super impressive power system, but it'll be something small, something to uh, keep us going for at least the beginning, uh, which means we're going to need to, first of all, get rid of that. And I have, a, this is my fortune pick, so yeah, it, just, it doesn't even matter. Oh, I should go check out my quarry. I have no clue how much progress it made in the uh, period of time that I've been offline. Now, I've been offline mainly because, well, for a while I was sick. Um, I just, uh, from, it was, how long was I, oh goodness, what the hell is this? This is not good water. Okay, let's get rid of it, get rid of it, get rid of it. Ow. This water is giving me wither, I think. Yeah. Ouch! Oh goodness, this nausea. But um, for quite some time I was sick. Oh my god, come on, let me out. Ah, this nausea is terrible. But I was sick. I had a cold for about. Oh, I can't even. I can't even place these blocks properly. I had a cold for just under a week, and I couldn't talk at all during that period of time. So no videos for a little while, and then I got over it finally. And I got over it like on Sunday. Pretty much is when I was finally all done and over with it. But um, after I got over it, then I got really busy because computer science always happens at the worst of times. Um, let me just hop back up here. I'm going to also change this back to the default. Or we can try out this JC Mix Pack, although that means that we're going to have to wait once again for uh, everything to everything. Come on. Come on. Come on. Any day now. 
Why do you take so long to switch texture packs? I guess while we're waiting for this... Oh, there we go. I was going to say, while we're waiting for this, I can talk about... Ooh, this one is different. Very, very different. Uh, I just want to throw some items into a chest so I can properly mine everything. But before we do that, I want to go dump some of this coal into the quarry system because I can only assume that it's not currently running and I don't have any buckets. Screw it. I don't even care. I'm just going to go to the quarry and hope that, well, we'll get, well, we'll be able to see the progress. I don't think it made a huge amount of progress because, well, the thing is not, uh, properly, ooh, did this, oh, okay, I was going to be like, did this make like absolutely no progress? The thing is not entirely hooked up correctly, but at the very least, it's, it's going down. It's going down, which is good. Um, but we do need to give this thing a bunch of coal. Nope. I said a bunch of coal. Okay. Do it. I don't know why that wasn't, why that wasn't, wasn't incorrectly. We'll give you a bunch of coal, like take a stack of coal. And then we'll give you a bunch of coal. The only problem is you also need... Uh, I only have lead ingots on me. That's unfortunate. You need water to function, and you don't have water to function, so maybe I shouldn't give you that. So let's just go to home. And I'm pretty sure this texture pack is not something I want to look at. <laughs> it's just not not what I want. It's just... Yeah. Okay, come on. Come on, game. Just switch me over to the default texture pack, and we can all be one big happy family. Okay. Thank you. I need just a bucket. Ah, uh, let's see. Do I have... Is this lead? No, that's Ferris. Uh, where the heck are... Lag! <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of just where all of this stuff is. You're not what I care about. You're sort of what I care about. You're not at all what I care about. Why is this so... Ooh, actually, something I wanted to try out was, can I make quartz? Wait, what? No, this stuff. Okay, can I make quartz with this mimicry stuff? Click. Ah, uh, nether quartz flakes. I don't think I can turn just quartz into... Yeah, into that. That's unfortunate, because I really wanted to be able to just mass-produce quartz with the mimic right that I have. Like, if I were to take this and then combine these two things, would I get more? No, I would not. That's most unfortunate. Ah, uh, that really sucks, because we need tons of quartz. Luckily, with uh, the mod pack, this mod pack in particular, um, all the quartz that we need to make our enemy system can be used from the nether quartz that we get from the nether, which is just absolutely fantastic. Okay, um, we're going to need some of these. Nope, we're going to need some steam dynamos because they are the main source of power for our base, essentially, which means we're going to need a lot of copper and some redstone transmission coils, which is just silver and redstone. So I need to figure out where I put all of my ores because last time I checked, they were over there. They oh, they're over here. Okay, so let's take three of these. And let's make ourselves a... That's tin, not iron. I am just the best at this game. One, two, three. Uh, also, do we have silver in here? We have steel. We have plenty of steel. We have tin, electrum, invar. I have, like, no silver. Wow. Imagine that. I'm missing a resource. Uh, let's just take that. Uh, I really just want to get everything to work. Except that's proving to be far harder than it needs to be. Okay. My inventory is way, is too damn full. Let's just throw our semi-valuable stuff into here because this seems to be our chest of stuff. Oh, we're going to need you. We're also going to need these leadstone energy cells, and I guess we'll keep that, but I don't need that. Ah, no, these aren't valuables. Those are invaluables, and by that I mean not valuables because invaluable still means valuable. Silly English. Tricks are for kids. But, um... What I wanted to do is just make enough space down here for me to comfortably fit a power delivery system. A basic one that I can upgrade in the future. Yeah, it'll be just... It'll be really, really simple. Uh, so we're going to want this leadstone stuff up here. Oh, did I show you guys the recipe for these? These are also really easy to make. Really freaking easy. Okay, so now that we got those, we can just do this. That's why I have a bunch of lead in my inventory, because that was, like, the main, the main focus of my... Uh, current adventures okay where is the middle this looks like the middle right indeed it does okay and we'll just plop these what 
Oh, these are just the frames. We still need the uh, cell, which is just copper and a redstone conductance thing. So I made the conductance coils, apparently, which are pretty mildly easy. Okay, wait. So we have the frames. We just need copper. These are just that. Okay, let's just go grab some copper, and then we'll be able to use these these darned things. Okay, so let's... For now, we're going to probably be going up and down a bunch, and I don't currently have ladders or anything in my inventory, so we'll just make a staircase, and we'll leave that there for now. I'm saying now way too many times. Uh, we're going to need... We're going to need copper. And then we can just take these, do that. Oh, oh my goodness. Three, four, and let's just do that. That and you. Let's make our cells of energy. Yay. Just what I needed. I got a new pop filter from my microphone. Just a random segue. And I'm really liking it. It's it's a much higher quality one than the other one. Not that pop filters are particularly uh quality based. Okay, wait. I need to figure out exactly how I want to have these laid out so this can be made modular. Uh we're gonna do this. We'll have two on each side. And then we can uh, pretty much just surround a cable by a near infinite amount of them. Um, so if we do this, then we can just do that. And then we need a way to... Well, I can see that one didn't really give much of a care about how it was set up. Uh, let's see. Let's break you. And we're going to need to make a wrench, I believe. Let's see. Uh, oh, wait. No, we don't need a wrench. I think these are configurable within their... Uh, within their respective menus, but we need we need a way to actually deliver power to these because we don't actually have one of those right now. Uh, so what I'm going to do is just set up... What kind of dynamos do we have? Is there anything other than the steam dynamos that would be... Well, we have the magmatic, the compression dynamo. I don't really know what to use with that. And the reactant dynamo. I think we're going to probably end up using the compression one in the future. Actually, I can just do the Google this. Compression dynamo. Uh, Dynamo, feed the beast. I need a compression one. Nope. That's not a page on the compressor compression Dynamo. It uses oil, fuel, ethanol, or biofuel. Oh, actually, we can use a... We can slowly start to work on a biofuel generator, but that won't be for quite some time, so... Maybe not yet. <laughs> uh, so let's just set this up over here. So we're just going to have a large row of dynamos in the future. We can worry about populating this when we need to. Do I hear... Is there a zombie in my basement? No. It's probably outside. Ah, uh, so... Yeah, I'm so happy to finally be back into recording. Uh, break is right around the corner, too. So, I mean, other than the uh, inevitable amount of studying that I'm going to need to do for all of my tests that are coming up... I'll be able to record a bunch in the following week, which I am really, really looking forward to. Okay. Zombie Man, if you could not spawn under here, that would make me like 40 flavors of happy. Uh, let me throw... Ow! What? Just get out of here! Just get out of here! No! Just leave! You aren't needed. Uh, let's see. Since these are gonna be steam dynamos for now, I might as well make... Okay, do I have my aqueous accumulator? No, I do not. Uh, okay, we're going to also need to grab some food. And by food, I mean we're going to need to go saturate ourselves using the uh, the wonderful saturation crystals. I really need to just make a bunch of these because they are truly... Okay, the first one apparently didn't take. They are truly wonderful. And there we go. Ha ha! Now we can go fast. We can hop high. We can just do... Ah! Just hit my... Uh, just hit my pop filter. Um, what did I come up here to get? I totally came up here to get the few machines that we had. And by that, I mean we need the pulverizer. Wait, where's the aqueous accumulator? There you are. We're also going to need some water, which I'm pretty sure I accidentally drained. Let's make two buckets just so we don't need to worry about coming back again. And ah, ah so much crafting. So much crafting indeed. It's... It's the struggle. It's the struggle of Minecraft where you have to do so much crafting. How is my armor doing? It's slowly dying, but still kind of alive. I'm pretty sure I have, like, pretty awful enchants. Yeah, they aren't particularly good. Although we do have unstable on our boots. If I had a source of gunpowder, I could probably... I think you can do something really cool with unstable. Ah, uh, stupid algae is in the way of me getting my water. And now that we have that, we can head back using slash home. 
And we can just make ourselves an infinite source of water. Yay! Oh, hi there, creepy Minecraft music. You're always the best. It's my favorite. Okay, let's... I really need some lights because it is dark down here. It is very dark. Uh, let's do this. Uh, boop, boop. And now uh, we can just boop the rest of this to the fullnessification. Silent fullification. Okay. So now that we've got that... We can do this. Uh, I'm trying to think of the single best way that I could hook up the most things to it, and I think it'll be like that. And you're going to get water now. Woohoo! And we really don't have a lot of these, so <laughs> it's not much of a power delivery system yet. But at the very least, it will be a power delivery system. I need to keep this thing like constantly fueled just so I can uh, have it generate energy while I'm away. While I am AFK. So for now... Whoa! That texture has totally changed from what it used to be. Uh, and these should be getting power, maybe? Uh, let me think. What is this? This is like... I don't know. I saw something that was like... Tu oh, tutorial. I'm like, tutorial? What is a tutorial? Okay, so you're not get. Oh, you are getting power. So blue is getting power, I think. Red is releasing power. So let me try to configure this properly you're not the color you're red okay now i think you should be outputting power yes you're outputting power and i need uh which color did i change i changed the corner let's change you to red and we'll change you to red oh red on that side and blue on the other so that's top and this is ah this is so difficult to configure okay so much blue. There we go. Except for you, you're still not blue. You're orange, and now you're blue. Okay. And you're red, and I need you to be all blue. Except for this edge right here. Ah! Oh, that was a scary sound. Uh, you red. Okay. Now these should all, at the very least, be uh, receiving power. And we can focus on uh, making them better in the future, but... The good thing is, we are now making power. Yay! Uh, we should hook up some basic machines over here. Let's see. Oh, hi there, Mr. Man. Oh, goodness. You have a fishing rod. And you're dead now. You no longer have a fishing rod. I would send you my condolences, but I don't particularly have any. So we're not going to. Um, now what I want to do is set up like a nice grinding system and a decent furnace system just so we have everything ready to go let's see we need we need more powered furnaces in general do i where is my power uh, oh we don't even have any so let's make a bunch uh powered furnace you're not a powered furnace no they're not even called powered furnaces anymore they're redstone furnaces these things okay we need bricks Ooh, do i have bricks I don't know if we have bricks and copper gears. We need a ton of copper. Oh, my God. We're going to need to go, like, copper mining soon. Let's just convert, like, the entirety of our everything. So, uh, wait. So, we're going to need machine frames, which is iron and gold. Uh, okay. We have gold, iron. We don't have any machine frames. We also don't have any glass. I really need to find, like, a good source of glass because that is what is holding me back far too often and the uh only problem is um out of all the glass all the sand that i get i can turn it into glass using mimicrite and those stupid trees and it uh gives me double the yield but it's still like finding the actual sand there are no desert biomes anywhere remotely close to where i am so every time i need sand i headed down over here and just mine a little bit of sand and it's really not an effective way of doing things <laughs> it's a very ineffective way of doing things and it's almost all gone now because i've been slowly peeling away at it so essentially in a nutshell i just really need to find myself a good source of sand because this ain't cutting it <laughs> and this won't be cutting it for that much longer because i've taken almost all of the sand from this area uh, let's just grab all of it. Like, we need a bunch of sand, and it's just never enough sand, because sand is apparently some sort of 
super valuable thing that I can never get enough of, and I think that might be clay, which is actually good because we need clay for uh, the powered furnaces. So let's grab them. Such, such resources. Okay, let's grab all of our stuff. I love this, this shovel. It's so, so good. I guess one way that we could get like unlimited amounts of sand is just by going to the deep ocean. Ah, this this thing moving through this water, it's so difficult. Ah, okay, come on. We'll slowly grab all of this stuff. And then we will be golden for at least a little while before we're no longer. Ouch, we're drowning, I forgot. Can't breathe underwater. Breathing underwater is bad for your health. Don't try it, kids, it's, it's dangerous. I take no responsibility in the bad choices that you make if you do decide to breathe underwater. But on the bright side, we did get a decent amount of sand. And on the brighter side, watch how easy it is to cook it up. Oh, look, my inventory is completely full. Ah, there's a stupid tree guy out there. And I just really don't... What the heck is liquefacted coal? I, I just found a thing that apparently gives you a ton of energy. I've got to figure out if it is possible to uh, mass produce this. Okay, so now that we got this, let's just grab a bunch of mimic right. I want to say that I can just do this, and it'll yield lots of, yep, two stacks of glass, which is good. So two stacks per stack, which is fantastic, actually. Uh, and then can we turn our clay into it? Like, if I were to do this, that gives me two hardened clay, which, unfortunately, I don't give a crap about. Wait, this is clay. I just want I guess we have to pulverize it <laughs> of all the things okay let's just go pulverize our clay you have power right yes you do really like really do I need to break this with my nub well, that's mildly annoying okay really game there we go laggy game is laggy just do this. I really should get a fortune shovel, and it wouldn't be difficult at all. But here I am, not not doing that. Uh, but okay, we have 28 clay. Will this? Yes, that will double our yield. That is good. Okay, so now that we have some bricks and some of the rest of the stuff, we need that back again. Um, let's just grab a bunch of it, and let's start crafting Minecraft with 100% more crafting. Okay. So if we do this, this, and then this, and this, did we do it the right way or did we mess up? We did it the wrong way. That's not a surprise at all. I should just do it backwards every time and then it'll finally be the right way. Okay, so now that we have those, we're gonna need to uh, copper bricks. Let's bricks, let us brick. Uh, where did I put my, there they are. Turn yourselves into 14 of those. Uh, I guess we'll have seven have that uh we need copper gears of course we do which means we need wood gears which do i even have wood that i can use because the uh dark wood that i'm using for the house i they're the great wood that i'm using for the house i don't want to use on uh, the not house and actually yeah unfortunately normally i would squeeze this or grab rubber out of this but there really is no point. Actually, I need to make a. I want to make a tree farm out of this, and then use that to power the um, dynamos. Although I'm not entirely sure if I can do that. I could probably use that um, to produce steam. Which, oh, what am I doing? That is not what I want to do. Um, I want to turn you into sticks, turn you into more sticks, turn you into even more sticks, and that's not. Oh my god, these stupid items in my inventory. Anything else that's dumb in my inventory that I can get rid of? Yes, there is. Okay, let's make these. Okay, that's enough to at least get started. This music is so peaceful. I love the Minecraft soundtrack. I don't know how many times I've mentioned it, but it always holds true that it is one of my favorite video game soundtracks. Okay, let's split this into three. What am I doing? I'm trying to get even stacks of them and there we go. Plenty of gears. Now, is this just copper around stone? Is it... Ah! Crafting is so difficult. No, it's around stone gears, so let's make a bunch of stone gears. I'm pretty sure I actually have a bunch of stone gears somewhere. So this was kind of a waste, but... Eh, there are worse things that we could waste our resources on. 
Okay. Let's just make myself 10 of these. And now that we got 10 of them, we can make 10 of these. Which means that we can only make five power furnaces, which is kind of unfortunate. But we're going to have to live with it. Okay. Ah, these are the reception coils. Man, we're almost out of gold. This is the last of our gold, I think. Uh, okay. More redstone than that. Okay. This is bad. We're out of gold, essentially. <laughs> this is the last seven gold. I'll, I'll mine off screen because our quarry is nowhere near gold level yet. Uh, so we'll do this. Then I believe this, this, and that. Then these. And then these. No? Oh, it's redstone at top. Wait, what? It's bricks, not copper. Ah, we made bricks for a reason. There we go. At least we have some furnaces now. Yay, our base has not only power, but utility now. Ha ha ha. Now, the question is, how much power do we have? Like, this power delivery system... Oh my god, these things are already almost... Oh, only one of them is almost full. I was going to say, Jesus, this thing is going ham. Um, Why aren't you producing steam? Oh, okay. <laughs> Trying to figure out why this thing isn't producing power. But it is. Uh, I could make a few more steam dynamos just so we have, like, a steady supply of power. Uh, let's see. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess I'll make a few of them. But we're going to need to make some more stone gears, which means we need cobblestone. And I should have cobblestone. I'd actually be extremely... Yeah, I was going to say, I'm going to be really surprised if I don't have cobblestone. Okay, let's take pretty much the entirety of these and make ourselves a bunch of those. Yeah, football! <laughs> football. Okay, and then we can just make a ton of those. We're not going to need 32 of them, I can tell you that much right now. But it's always good to have more for the future. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! I just made a mistake! That was all of our copper. I messed up, guys. I... Mmm... That's really unfortunate. I really messed up there. Oh, wait. Okay. Can I make more copper out of this Mimicrite? Yes! This is perfect. Haha. -ha. This is, this is like, actually fantastic because... <laughs> ah, there we go. We got copper again. Oh, goodness. What the hell? Ah, not what I wanted to do, but... Come on. Just merge back into normal copper. I did not want to make ingots. There we go. Uh, what do we need? Three, two, and those things. So, these things, these things, and those. Th oh, wait, nope. Redstone dust right there. Nope, and these need to be switched. And what the hell is happening? Ah! Why is this recipe so difficult? No. This goes right here. This goes right here, and this goes right... No? Okay, so that's that, that's that. Those are gears. That's copper, right? Yeah, what's wrong with this recipe? That's totally right. This is copper, redstone, copper gear, and transmission coils. This tr these are conductance coils. Oh my god, I'm such a derp. Do I have any silver? Going once, going twice. Yes, we do have silver. Okay. Why does this have to be so tedious? Okay. Make 16 of those. Transmission coil. That. Then our gears. And finally, the copper itself. Nope, that's the wrong way. These gears are supposed to be on the top. And the copper is supposed to be split like that. Okay. Okay. 12 steam dynamos. That's enough. <laughs> Actually, that's one too many to have an asymmetrical amount of them. Uh, let's see. Now I want to minimize the... <sighs> setting this up. We're going to need to have one right here. Oh, one right here. I don't even think we have the space to put these in here yet. Uh, so we'll do that. And then we're going to need two right here. Or, yeah, two like that. 
And then we need a way to sort of stagger these so we have um, constant supply of water going to all of them. So we're going to do this and this. And then if we just go... Let's see, I'm trying to think of how do I set this up so we can deliver uh, water to everything properly. Because I don't have a good water... It, maybe I should just... I should probably make liquid ducks. Uh, actually, I think they would change to fluid ducks or something like that. Uh, fluid duct. Okay, so fused quartz or hardened glass. Oh, nope. I said hardened glass. Ah! Let's craft with silent mystification is what this part is turned into. Okay, fluid duct. I don't care about fused quartz, but I do care about hardened glass. Is just lead and glass in an induction smelter. We don't have an induction smelter right now, but we could make one. No, I'm not going to make anything. I'm not going to craft anything else. I'm going to plan this out a little bit because right now, uh, I, I don't, I don't even, I don't even know, but, um, I also need to go get some more resources, but I'm going to call it a part here, guys. I do hope that you enjoyed it. It probably was a bit longer than I had expected. But that's okay, because it's been a while since I've recorded. I don't mind recording for a little bit longer than usual. It's always fun. If you guys enjoyed it, that's all the better. Uh, so, guys, if you enjoyed this part, a like would be most appreciated. It helps out a ton. Uh, also, if you're interested in hosting your own Minecraft server, uh, go check out the description. There's information to get 20% off of a server from Vioserve. We use them to host the public server, and they're pretty great. So I can only recommend them. And I only have good things to say about them. So, once again, I do hope you enjoyed this video. And I will see you all again next time. So until then, farewell.